shake a tail feather. Hey, Sarah. Ethan, your babysitter's here. Hey, guys. Hi. <laughs> oh, look at you, all dressed up for the senior prom. Nice suit. Check out Miami Vice. Stylish. Freeze turkey. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> look out. <laughs> Ethan's mom thought it'd be fun if we wore the same thing that we wore to our senior prom. I think it's really cool that you two are chaperoning this senior citizen's prom. Oh, senior prom. I just got that. So, who's ready to party? Grandma, you look hot. Thank you, sweetie. You look a little surprised, dear. Can a grandma get her groove on? I have no idea how to answer that. Okay. So what do you think? <laughs> this is the exact same dress I wore for my senior prom. It's a little 1981, isn't it? Well, yes, I know. That's the point. Mom, I bet it looked great 30 years ago. Yeah, grandma could loan you something out of her closet. Okay, maybe I should change. Oh, no. I don't want to miss the vote for prom queen. I'm the three-to-one favorite. Let's drop it like it's hot. <laughs> yes, yes. Good night. Have fun, guys. Okay. Jacuzzi time machine starts in T-minus two minutes. I'll get the drinks. I'll get the popcorn. Can I stay up late tonight? If you promise not to tell your parents that we're letting you watch Jacuzzi time machine. Deal. I always sit beside Ethan on movie night. Oh, oh, I get it. You two want to, uh, canoodle. No, we don't. As if. Canoodling is the absolute last thing I want to do. Well, you know, not like the last thing in the world. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Got to work on my roof landing. Rory? Uh, uh. She's the girl next door. Nice to die in a heart that's pure. She's the girl next door. She's free. What you get is what you see. No more ladies, maybe. just rope them to the 80s. The leg warmers are all wet. My favorite part is coming up. How do you know? It's all static. Because we're 92 minutes in. He knows this movie off by heart. That's really pathetic. I'm so bored. Hey, if you hadn't knocked out the satellite dish, we'd all be enjoying Jacuzzi Time Machine right now. I think Grandma's making out with her boyfriend right now. Oh, Jane? Come on. You. Don't you have some cards? My parents might have some old board games in the basement. Okay, we got math a lot, village. Too much math. Word strike? Requires spelling. You got anything in a nice non-educational flavor? Oh, check this out. Spirit speaker. Host a seance and make contact with the spirit world. <coughs> now we're talking. Let's meet up with some honeys from the other side. What's a seance? It's like a ritual conducted to make contact with spirits. Dead spirits? Those things give me the creeps. I thought they were banned from toy stores. This one looks seriously old. I don't think we should mess with it, guys. What's the big deal? It's just a board game. It's what it represents that scares me. Oh, come on. Just one little game. Unless you're scared. Yeah, I'm a chicken. Bok, bok. Jean and I are going to go play dress up. Try not to make a mess. She has got to loosen up. Well, what do you say, girls? For a little supernatural action? I 
Like a dish towel is really necessary. Do you want this to work or not? Okay, the other set of sleepover ones. Everybody, two fingers on their respective corners. Now, all we have to do is just summon a spirit and ask the question. Maybe Sarah was right. I don't, I don't think we should mess with this thing. We don't know who or what is out there in the ether. Look, we're hanging out with vampires. We've taken down zombies. We pruned a haunted tree last month. What's a little voice from beyond? Point taken. But we're reading the rules first. Fine, Mom. Okay. Rule number one, never play alone. Rule number two, always finish your session by saying goodbye and waiting for the spirit to leave the board. Rule number three, do not remove fingers from the board until the spirit's been properly dismissed. Failure to do so can have catastrophic results. Oh, catastrophic Ooh. results. Oh, Benny, come on, this is serious. Okay. okay. Rule number four, never ask, is there anyone out there who wants to talk to us, as such an open invitation tends to attract evil entities. Got it? Sweet. All right, I'll start. All right. Oh, great seance board. Are there any friendly, gentle, preferably hot spirits hot? who'd like to hang with us dudes? Yes! Sweet! <laughs> now what? Uh, I'll ask it a question. Right. Uh, are you a chick spirit? Yes! Oh, a chick, right on. <clears throat> Will the world end in the year 2012 as the Mayans predicted? Oh, no! Darn it. We have to study for my final exams. Is there intelligent life on other planets? Uh, she doesn't know. Does she know what the Force is? Has she transcended the space-time continuum? Has she ever met a Borg? We're all three of you geeks. Mm, pretty much, yeah. No, I've got one. Will we be cool? No. Not even in college? Ever? Okay, this is lame. I'm sure you were a hottie back when you had legs, but you were officially dismissed, Chiquita. Goodbye. Let's go get a snack. Good idea. Wait, guys, come back. You're on your own, dude. We haven't talked to any Babylonian babes yet. Hey, sup, is anyone out there? conversed with? No. Didn't think so. Okay. It's getting weird. Uh, guys, I think it's trying to tell us something, but I don't know what. It may be another language. Yeah, yeah like evil speak. Okay. I know it's not cool for a dude to be freaked out, but I am a freaked out dude right now. You played alone. Rory, it's the number one rule. Never play alone. Okay. Okay. What do we do? I don't know. It's going crazy. Okay. Okay. Let's all just put our hands on the board. Right. You first. Why me? This is your idea. Okay. Together. On three. One. Two. Three. <laughs> oh, I think it worked. Oh, we just really ticked it off. Let's try to spell something. Look. Hands off. Hands off what? The board? Yes, 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 it said yes. Well, what do we do? Take your hands off the board. Okay. That's the number two rule. Do not take your hands off the board unless the ghost 
says goodbye, or it can escape the spirit realm. But it told it to let go. Of course it did. It's a ghost stuck in the Netherlands, and now it wants out. I think you mean Netherworld. Yeah, that. Uh. Ghosts in your bodies? It's on mine. I would definitely feel it if it was in mine. Uh, I don't feel any different. Maybe it never left the board. Grab that. Okay. No more seances. Ever. Got no problem with that. Whoa! Sarah? I don't know what your babysitter's done to herself, but I like it. Does anyone else think that Sarah seems a little different? <laughs> nah. Well, okay. Maybe I see what you're getting at. Seen a girl eat like that. Oh. Sarah, why don't we just come of senses here? Oh, definitely not Sarah. You thinking what I'm thinking? The ghost that escaped from the seance board? Found a body and like can't say I blame it. You gotta admit, she looks like a lot more fun. Ah. Oh, yeah, if she wasn't trashing my house. Oh no. No, no, not the cake. Please, no. Please, please. My mom just made that cake for a book club tomorrow. She needs research recipes. Oh, wait, please. I like her style. Ethan, where's Sarah? We think she's possessed by a ghost from the Netherlands. Sorry. <laughs> she's just getting you guys a snack. Be right up. I have got to try that cake. Benny. What? It's not like your mom can feed it to her book ladies now. Okay, it's your cake. I get it. Sarah. Sarah? Are you in there? You look as on Sarah. Stop. Stop. Okay? Just put down the trophy. Dude, it's just a bowling trophy. No, it's the only trophy my dad has ever won. Ever. Okay, that's it. This party is over. I command you to return to the board and go back to wherever it is you came from. Big mistake. Empty. Uh, guys, I think I know where she is. What the heck was that? I guess I'd say some kind of demon has taken over Sarah's body. Oh, this was a bad idea. I told you a seance was a bad idea. It was your idea. Okay, now is not the time to be throwing blame around, Ethan, but while we're on the topic, I'm not the one who invited Casper the Psycho Ghost in. It was an accident. Okay, let's assess. We have an evil demon who's taken possession of a fledgling vampire's body who has trapped your little sister inside your bedroom. Right, right. Well, then, there's only one thing to do.
until you give me my sister back. What is this stuff? Uh, no. It feels so dirty. Oh, wait. It's ectoplasm, the physical manifestation of paranormal energy. Oh, cool. cool. Check this out. It's an EMF app that I jerry-rigged to detect paranormal activity. Whoa. These are some high readings you got here. Okay. Well, I'll be leaving now. And no. No. We have to think this through. What would the Ghostbusters do? Well, they use streams of lightning plasma to suck ghosts into their containment boxes. Do we have any of that stuff? No. All we have that sucks is a vacuum. My dad has a leaf blower that we could kick into reverse. Nothing strong enough to hold a spirit as nasty as this, though. Well, there is one thing I know of that can suck up spirits and hold them. Once we suck the soul out, we'll need a place to contain it. The cubule animus? Seriously, this is a really bad idea. I mean, if a seance was bad, this is a seriously, majorly messed up bad idea. Are you gonna help us, or what? Are you really sure we should be doing this? Huh? Oh. Unlucky board cube? Oh, come on, my star projector! That was a gift! She better not throw my limited edition Heckbot Superflyer. Dig. Huh. Let's do this. Stop. Hey, Ethan, why'd you just text me one of your baby pictures? Oh, oh, she just emailed this to the entire school. Oh, that's it. This is on. the cubile animus. All right. Let's get your little sister back. Okay. Let her rip. Go ahead. Did you check the fuel? Yes, I checked the fuel. I already told you twice I filled it up. Uh, maybe the couplings you made for the tubing are malfunctioning. Oh, here we go. So everything I built is faulty. Everything you built is golden. You know, I don't like your tone. Oh, really? Yes, really. You always get defensive whenever... Defensive? Yes, defensive. Th You're pulling that card right now. I am. Guys! You're pulling that. Guys! Did you try the power switch? Hey, Mom. 
Hey, Dad. Hey, guys. Hey. How was the uh, senior prom? Well, it was a little slower than I remember. Where's Grandma? The captain of the lawn bowling team took her to the Pancake Palace for the midnight buffet. Yeah, I don't know where she gets her energy. I'm going to bed. I'll be right up. Okay. So, I understand you're the new president of the Whitechapel Justin Bieber fan club. What? Well, Rory's parents are working the dessert table. They showed us your status update. Are you, um, sure you want to sign up for figure skating? Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks. Nothing to worry about. Okay. Good night. Justin Bieber? Really? It wasn't me, remember? Did you take care of the Kubilei Animus? Yeah, I hit it really well. That thing is never gonna bother us again.